work out from the gym. Uh, I don't go to the gym. I mostly just walk and lift uh, kettlebells. Uh, that's why my workout sucks. I don't have the money to go to the gym. <laughs> I have to save every penny. I don't know if you guys know this, but uh, I've been unemployed for a little while. So uh been working on getting a better job, working on going back to school, getting a getting a degree in uh, radiography, which is kind of why uh, I've been kind of quiet lately. I've been working behind the scenes trying to deal with uh, college shit. Uh, well, I guess technically it's not it's not a uh, degree. It's a uh, it's community college stuff. So it's infinitely cheaper. You know, you're not beholding as much to the government. Uh, you know, all that shit. But uh, you know, I'm I'm trying to. The computer science thing just isn't fucking working. It's very difficult to find a, a good job unless you move halfway across the country. And I like where I live. I like uh, you know, I like this area. I like uh, I like this city. I don't want to go anywhere else. I'm not obviously. I'm not going to say exactly where I live because people already people already kind of have an inkling. They know <laughs> where it is. So. The less information and less specifics I give, the better. Certification. Uh, yeah, it's basically like that. It's basically like a certification to, uh, to do all that stuff, to do uh, x-rays and all that stuff. <laughs> science, science is uh, non-hetero. Pantsu Party, oh, welcome kill to the kill stream. <laughs> How are you doing? Hey. <laughs> Hi, everybody. It's me. Uh, you can call me May. That's my human name. Okay, but it's well, me. I, you, uh, I run the YouTube channel Pantsu Party. I'm a Digi Bros fiance. What's your or Digi name? Nay. That's, that's what it is now. Okay. Oh. Now, Pantsu Pansu Party. May, you know, yeah, I call people by their gimmick names. <laughs> Fine, call yeah. me whatever. Oh, but I'll call you May. I mean, Pantsu Party is a, is a mouthful. And just, just hearing Ralph say Pantsu. And then just, just to call you <laughs> Pantsu. Like, it made my day, I must say. Now, you know where you're at, though. You're live on the kill stream. Tell everybody how you got here, what it is you do online, and all that stuff. Uh, I'm I'm Digi Nay's uh, fiance. I make anime YouTube videos. Uh... Yeah, I've been around for the past three years. I am a big fan of the show. Uh, I try what? to watch it every night. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Well, I'm a patron. That. <laughs> I've been what? in the sex chat like all day just <laughs> chatting to people. Nice. Now, how did you get I became I became a really uh. big fan after the monkey drama because you had <laughs> the kitty out a couple of times. And like, Digi and Monkey, they're... You know, they're rivals, right? So uh, it was just really funny. <laughs> Actually, we had uh, Digibro on during that uh, time, too, as well. Oh, my God. I thought you were about to that say Monday classic. Matt. Usually it's the, oh, you know, I came on after Monday Matt. But I liked that it was after the monkey theme because that was one of the funniest arcs we had all last year. Maybe the funniest to me. When we had Lou on reading the text messages, I still can't. Uh, oh, yeah, Rand. Wasn't it Rand reading them, yes. too? Yes. It was he so was, funny. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> that was a crazy arc there. Now, uh, what's going on with Digibro lately? Um, I, originally, I wasn't even really going to talk about this, but I know you told the the secretary that you kind of wanted Digi to talk May. about Digimay. Digi 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 yeah. She's May. Well, it just so happens that all this crazy shit is going down right when I'm trying to launch my YouTube channel. So I was like, legitimately like, Ralph, I know you want to get a girl on. I know you want somebody who's edgy and fun. So I'm like, you know, have me on. And then all this shit happens. And I'm like, perfect opportunity. <laughs> now, we'll tell people what it is that's actually happening exactly. And I have some photos here on this on the thing. And I'll try to pull those up. So but... a couple of days ago, uh, did you By the May... way, let me say this too. Call, calls are open. We're doing open calls. So throw out the link. Not oh, yeah. Answer. Bring it on, guys. <laughs> I'm ready. Fuck, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Digi came out a couple of days ago out of the closet and uh, announced that they are now transitioning. Um, and they are now Digi Nay. Now, um, so transitioning into they're going to consider themselves female or? Yes. Okay. They, they are considering themselves female now. It's Digi okay. Nay. <laughs> now, you can it's imagine official. this. The YouTube prior. channel name was changed. <clears throat> You can imagine, probably not going to go over that well with the uh, with the audience here. I I would assume, but we're going to see how the colors go. Now, here here is the photo. I think we showed this photo the other day. I didn't really talk about it because I, not that much, because somebody I was talking to somebody and they thought maybe he was trolling. Like this might not even be real. 
And so for a couple oh, of days, absolutely I, real. Yeah. I'm pretty certain it's real now at this point. Uh, but in the, you know, when it was first breaking, I didn't know for sure if he was fucking around or whatever. Uh, I, I thought he was joking at first when I saw, I was like, Oh yeah, this is, this is obviously like a bit. And then I saw the video. He was talking about how Ranma was his favorite character from Ranma one half. And I'm like, Nope, this is real. By the way, well, there's a little bit of honesty behind every joke. And like, She's been saying she admires like Ranma and wants to fucking be able to transition into a woman at any time. So there was always a little bit of truth behind that. Rumiko Takahashi has ruined an entire generation of men. <laughs> now, <clears throat> um, somebody said, believe Ralph... me, the world is better off this way. Well, the world we... is way better off with Digi considering herself a woman. Uh, why do you say that? Because, well, at least for me, she's brushing her teeth now. No, wait a minute. <laughs> what? And now you wait a minute. Is this just a, is, oh god! Sorry. Sorry. Was this just a whole bit so that Digi would just start being cleaner? Was that it? You you just floated the suggestion. It's like you know, a real woman would brush their teeth and comb their hair. And <laughs> oh boy, I mean, maybe a little bit of that is is true. Maybe I'm a little bit more okay with this. <laughs> because the hygiene factor has went up. Is that, okay, I didn't... All right, now... Well, I don't know if you know this, but Tinchine is known for having a phimosis cock and never brushing her teeth. I oh, no. That yeah. is like the legacy. I, I did not need to know that. <laughs> now, explain the uh, the phimosis or phys whatever the term is. What, is. what does that mean exactly? Phimosis is a medical condition where uh, you're, you yeah. have a foreskin and it's a little bit longer. It actually makes sex feel better because your dick is more sensitive. All right, you're you mean out. vagina now. <laughs> Don't be insensitive. Chat She's not getting a surgery. I don't yeah, think I'd be okay with that. But it's a female dick now. so It's, it's a, true, it's, it's true. It's a feminine penis dick. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Chat is it's absolutely adorable. losing their shit right now. Lick, lick. <laughs> okay. Um, chat, please, please call in. Let's get some calls. Oh boy, in yes, here. please. I'd love to hear you. Uh, let's see. Where, where are we at? Lord Zenu, WC lost his weight. I'm confused. This chick is engaged to a tranny. Um, I, th I think that's the case, right? Transgender. Yes. Yes. But they, I'm engaged. Well, you know what? That's a fair point, though. Like, look, uh, they weren't uh, transitioning, however you want to put it, uh, when you got together. Is there a part of you? You seem to be uh, completely upbeat and on board with the whole thing. But uh, I, I can imagine known a about lot this of women. for a very long time. Okay, well, like, that's true, too. Uh, yeah, how long okay. have she you has been, been like, publicly um, gender fluid for a long time, and me, too. Um, so it's not surprising that this would happen. Really? Wait, do you have a dick? No, I don't have a dick. I'm just asking. I'm asking. No, the I am a biological woman. This is how I would describe myself. I am a woman, but I feel like a man is piloting my body. What? So, what does that mean? It just From means behind? I kind of have like a male soul. I Do can relate to men way more easily. Oh. I mean, I would be interested. I've never tried it. I honestly have it. I'm kind of scared, but I would I would try it. But I've only taken cock. I've never given it. I think you should uh, float the suggestion to Disney to see if uh, they would be into it. Oh, we have, we uh, have, we have obtained goods to try it. But I'm uh, still really scared. Oh my God. I think you should, uh, you know, just the just take the face and just live stream the live just the live facial reaction. Oh I, my I think God! Only people fans might be interested. When... Nah. <laughs> Let me read this. Oh, Let me read this. How much do you think I'd get for that? I might make an only oh, right. try it. Money, oh, sure. All right. Robbie don't care says smash. Uh Mega Meme says, Is Lolly okay if you self insert as the little girl? I don't even know what that yes. means. <laughs> yes. Wait, I mean, that's oh what Lolly is. Most what Lolly is drawn mean? by Hold women. On. Explain what that means because I don't know. I, I'm not, you know. An aficionado. Shut what, it down. what does that mean? Self insert not an anime person. as the little okay. girl. What does that so mean? So it means that when you're you're thinking about the scenarios being depicted from the perspective of the child. So you're not thinking about fucking a child. You're thinking about being no. in your most vulnerable state, being mm. destroyed. 
Oh, I don't know. No. That sounds that sounds not good. Oh, no. But well, let's Bro. keep going. No. Disavow. I have to disavow. Lord Zeta Desi Laws. Lord I'm, I'm, a, I'm a free speech advocate, so like I am definitely in favor of like Lolly hentai. <laughs> <laughs> so All if right. anybody has questions about that, I'd love to what talk. The fuck? What happened? All right. Minnesota is burning down now. The yeah. kill stream is I'm burning so happy down. I'm Worski is on right now. This is like the best case scenario of my night. <laughs> All right, let's... Chris O. Yes, Chris O. Eighty six says, "For fuck's sake, what did I just walk in on?" Proud and Frank Denier says, "Do not encourage this demon." Is what he said. Captain seriously says, "No, don't stop. No, don't stop." Southern Ningo says, I wish the man poly... Oh, God damn it. I can't. <laughs> he says, I wish, I wish the man piloting your body was Kobe's pilot. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's the best one I've ever heard. Thank you. Oh, my God. Amazing. Uh, that was pretty good, yeah. I have to say. So good that I couldn't read it at first. All right. Uh, Herod Silvatici says, I blame Dustin Hoffman and Tootsie. All right. <laughs> there is Pensive Cowboy says, what the fuck is this shit? Also, this guy. <laughs> Thank you. Also, this guest has an enormous nose. What could that mean? I'm going to. Somebody already mentioned this earlier, so I guess I'll let you address that. I'm going She's to. Italian. Yeah, I'm going to vomit. How could you find people more degenerate than Warski? The comments. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, we're on the same level, yo. <laughs> um, yeah, somebody accused you of being a Jew earlier. You said you said you were Italian, not Jew. Italians yeah, are not Italian. that big. Nose if only too. I was Jewish, the ADL would love to protect me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a <laughs> rare. You'd, you'd probably be on the Twitch uh, safety council right now, oh, or something. Absolutely. <laughs> Right. Instead of Italian. Let's stay respectful. The the uh, we're on Ralph, the line. Shut up. The, Ralph, shut up. the legal the legal you vixen idiot. the legal vixen says I am against this dumb bra. That's not very nice. All right, let's take some colors. Ralph, everyone, everyone, take it easy. Yeah, that's gonna work. You just inflamed it even more. You oh my just God, I avow, I avow. Right. Stop being so seriously. I came on here for this. All right, uh, May here, Pantsy Party. Oh, well, uh, I had a quick something before. I saw the Turkey right, Town video look, look, on look, the, look, on the look. Hey Tree and King drama. And, yeah, well, uh, look, hey, wait, hold on. We'll go We'll go well, to the Ace Tree thing. Yeah, hold on. Yeah, over that. yeah, yeah, we're not doing that right now. We're not doing that right now. Yeah, don't, wait, don't Turkey get Tom, here. isn't he like 10? Turkey Tom? I don't know. He's I mean, are you attracted to him more or what? Uh, now, wait a minute. Hold on. <laughs> are you going to self insert? Like now, hold on. Wait. Come on now. Oh, my God. You guys are going to be on my stream. Christ. I have my mods literally go in my green room and just ask people if they're oh. ready. Yeah, well, we used to have somebody like that, and he got stoxed and ran off the show. So that's why we don't have him anymore. So well, I'm yeah, not afraid of being dodged. You didn't. Think, well, I mean, are me you, either, because everybody knows me. But... <laughs> <laughs> yes. uh, what the gender fluid to be? How is this just not role playing split personality disorder? Okay, how is this not disservice to people with legitimate split personality disorder? All right. There's no legitimate split personality disorder. I think it also includes them. And I think it's way more common for people to have a split personality, but like be more aware of it. Um, like maybe just like a different persona. But I do think like for me, at least it kind of is like that. Like for me, it kind of is fun to just pretend, oh, well, what if I was a guy in this situation? But yeah, that's kind of just how I feel about it. Like I think some people might might see it that way, but like, there are legitimately people out there who can't truly be themselves unless people recognize them for how they feel on the inside. Now you say that you feel, you think as if like, you know, you pretend to be a guy in this situation when earlier you said you have a male soul piloting your body. Yeah. I mean, it's a metaphor. <laughs> I'm like a uh, mech. I'm like a yeah. chick mech. She gunned him. All right, can I ask like you a couple of questions? Right I think he's in shock. All yeah, right. I know. Thank he, you, Magic Al. Thank you. Magic Al. Just like the chat. Just like the chat. Magic Al. Thank you, sir. I appreciate you calling in. Thank you, Ralph. May You're I welcome, just want to ask? 
Uh, two questions. One, are you in an open relationship? No, but for okay. Dick Masterson, maybe. Two, uh, oh you said God. you're Italian. That's all he needed to hear. <laughs> yeah, that's okay, right? Two, you said you're Italian. Are you very hairy? Not right now. I'm shaved. <laughs> but I can that's be if that's what you want. That's a yes. That's a yes. She is. <laughs> if that's what you want. All right. Oh, no. I'm Italian. Mustache. What do you want? My she hair is dark and thick. Right. That's how it be. She has a better mustache than I do. That's all I'm saying. All right, continue. <laughs> all right. Off hard. I have to pluck no. my mustache like every week. I know. <laughs> <laughs> we already, you already said you were Italian. All right, let's take another caller. Lude saying you're on the kill stream. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> so hey, uh, I just heard earlier the uh, Dick Masterson uh, stream from mm -hmm. Digibro or Diginay or whatever. Yeah, you know, I actually, and what, let me say this. I didn't actually hear the part with Diginay or Digi, Digi. I didn't hear the part with Digi in it uh, because after Brad my part, was literally right after. I know because I hung up. I was so fired up after that. I just hung up and went and did something else, and I still oh, haven't even listened to it yeah, because I, I know to I'm be on honest, it too. I haven't I listened like, past that yeah, point. Yeah, so. I didn't hear it. I'm sorry. I know I should have before the show, but I didn't. I anyway. fucking loved your fight with Nall. It was fucking legendary. I was so fired up. I just fucking hung up and went and fucking took a walk down the street. No shit. Okay, go ahead, call. Well, that well, that fight also surprised me. I didn't know you had a problem, and no. I don't nah, it's all that. good. Whatever. <laughs> we talk. We talk shit for a couple of minutes. It does. It's not a real problem. I would yeah. say. Yeah. Uh, go ahead. And so I was like, "Would you?" I don't know. <laughs> this is weird. Um, but you don't think you're a lesbian or nothing? Oh, I absolutely am. So you are. <sighs> yes. Oh, I was gonna say. I mean, Ralph just got divorced and everything. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not gonna put the wig. You love the show. No, no. You love no, no, the show. I mean, I can't. No, no. no I think no. I can do a little bit better than Ralph. That's why I'm aiming. Wow! <laughs> oh, wow! Oh. That's uh, well, go off. Well, go I mean, off. the current evidence says no, so I don't know what you mean. Oh, uh, but, uh, yeah. so, uh, Drop the hard R, Ralph. Drop the hard R. We know you I want know, to. You know, but <laughs> what, about an, what about an Andy Ralph combo? <laughs> what about you go kill so? yourself, caller? Get the fuck out of here. That's on All right. Fucking Bucks moron. Fucking sick fuck. <laughs> She go fucking hang yourself, you fucking piece of Ralph's shit. Ralph's cool enough. Ralph has to fucking bottle him. Oh Holy All right. shit. Ralph, you're yes. like one of my favorite people in the world, and I made a, I made a show. No, there's a caller like, who was, who was like pissing me off. Show. Like, he's going to something even more degenerate. It's like, shut the fuck up. Get out of oh here, my. you sick fuck. All right, let's take another caller. We can high five at the same time, Ralph. No, no. <laughs> what happens in Knoxville stays in Knoxville. <laughs> the Eiffel Tower, yes. The mega yes. powers unite. All right, let's take the next caller. Yeah. Beal says, tell the meat spin in the background to shut up. A0 <laughs> says, who has the bigger dick, you or Digi? Uh, Lord, I'd like to see for myself. Lord Zini WT Law says, Bibble, these are skinwalkers. Run. Christopher Woffin. <laughs> <laughs> Christopher Woffin says, I hate this show now. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Oh my gosh. There'll be another one tomorrow, regardless. Dumpter Gassy says, some of your guests, Ralph. Yes, I know. That's the idea. All right. Onion Bub says, sorry, I was in the other room eating. Are you sure Digibro has dysphoria? Given his past comments about seeing himself as the lolly when he looks at lolly porn, I think he might be autogenophile. P.S. Will you both be in white at your wedding? <laughs> what the fuck is autogenophile? And I actually want to wear actually. I want to wear the suit. It's where you just dogs. have a you have a fetish. You have a fetish for yes. for it. You're not really trans. Sexually aroused by the thought of it. I think that was words. kind of what they no. thought it was at first, but it just it's more than that, trust me. As he says, what the fuck is this? I changed my mind. I want Alsa back. A Hill Anderson says, AIDS kills. Certain people dead. Purge the stream now. Lord Zenu WT Law says, I didn't come here to get talked down to by trannies. That was a little. 
Heavy. Well, I think we've had a good conversation. Uh, Pensive Cowboy says, Caller, what you don't realize is that it's just a metaphor for mental illness. Unfortunately, we can't get real callers on, on this because the show would get showed from D Live and says something about flushing a certain personage. Uh, Pensive Cowboy says, This is proof that anime will make you into a disgusting, degenerate F word if you let it take over your life. How long until these two join a certain percentage crew? Minneapolis burning is the real metaphor. Uh, let's see. Ball says, congratulations on the big guest tonight. Never thought I'd see Paul from the Wonder Years on the kill stream. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's brutal. Oh, all right. Tranny <laughs> Destroyer says, like, tee hee hee hee. Oh, my God. Tee hee hee. Oh, oh, like, oh, my God. So funny. Hee hee. Get your neck stomp like Minneapolis. Oh, my gosh. Hee hee hee. Random Kawhi. <laughs> Damn. God damn oh, that was. Like, stop favorite. talking to this bitch. Just talk about <laughs> Minneapolis, please. All right, we're gonna talk about Minneapolis, I swear. Go ahead, uh, Pins of Cowboy. You're on the kill stream. Oh my god. At first I thought this was like a big fucking joke or something, but then <laughs> at some point I realized the shit was for real, dude, and I don't fucking know, man. Like I'm gonna choose my words because I don't wanna please. get the show banned or whatever, please, but please. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Yeah, like, I, okay. I don't think it's a joke. I'm, I'm pretty sure yeah, that's it's, 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 Unfortunately, it's clearly not a joke. Um, so, so yeah, um, 41% crew time. Uh, I don't feel bad about saying that, even if Dingo does. And, uh, yeah, y'all have a great night. <laughs> Thank you, Vince of the Cowboys. All right. That's uh, all he wanted to say. Was, Holy very fuck. mad of a fact. He didn't, he didn't even didn't I'm stutter. Glad he got out. Psalm, yeah. uh, Psalm 23, you're on the kill stream. Go ahead. <laughs> G'day, fellas. How you going? I was just going to say to this hole, you're going to burn in the fires of hell, and you and your molester will burn forever, and it's going to complete the cycle, and you're going to love the flame, because you're a sinner, and you know it. Thank you, Psalm Thank 23. You. Thanks, PPP. <laughs> 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 oh, my fucking God. I'm so sick of the IBS crowd, and... I'm not going to name like specific individuals, Gator. I'm not gonna name specific individuals um, who, you know, they hear about this cuties, this new Netflix movie that is degenerate and awful. Uh, by the way, I have no interest in this movie at all and hate that I search my name because um, I have to search my name because people fuck with me constantly. Uh, search my name, I'm Digibro by the way, hi. Um, type of Digibro on Twitter. And everybody's like, oh, did you bro likes cuties? First of all, first of all, I am not interested in black little girls, real little girls twerking. That's like the furthest fucking thing from what I'm into. Okay, look at this. I'm going to teach you guys. This is Shauna. Um, you're looking at this girl. You might, if you're, if you're a pervert, you're probably transposing, like, a real child, right? Because you think this is probably a child, because you're fucking retarded. Onto this, onto this drawing, you're like, oh, that looks like a little girl. Now, look closer. Look closer. Do you notice that she doesn't have a fucking nose? No distinguishing race? Has giant red eyes? No lips? Um, has perfect skin? Is radiant? Is... Uh, for a different dimension, complete, she's 2D. And this is an anime character who is, how old is she, 17? Yeah, well, probably like 15 at the start, but she it's doesn't- It's fucking anime. She doesn't grow I don't, when she I ages. literally, okay, this is another <laughs> problem I have with anime. Um, Violet Evergarden, I don't know if you guys watched Violet Evergarden. It's a fucking Kiyoani show about a child soldier. She is a, canonically a 14-year-old girl and does not look like- any different from the adult characters in the show at all so I don't know what the fuck is up with Japan honestly I don't care because this is not a fucking person this is a fucking drawing oh my fucking god if I have to deal with another one of you motherfuckers you don't want to know this is a 14 year old's ass in Violet Evergarden this is supposed to be this is a Kiyoani show this is supposed to be wholesome I just want you to know that like so, growing up a woman in the world in 2020, you just have to be sexy or else you're a failure. It doesn't matter if you're like 12, you're gonna see that if you're not sexy, people don't like you, people don't engage with you, um, everybody's taking fucking nude pictures on OnlyFans when they're fucking like 
18 and trying to go to college and they're fucking their college admission officers are like, oh fuck, um, all the girls in this new incoming class of fucking 2020, they all are fucking whores. Do we accept a bunch of prostitutes that are to our prestigious university? And they fucking have to because you fucking did this to me! Oh, hey everybody. It's been a long time, unfortunately. Or, you know, I could always look on the bright side. Uh, lots of changes have been going on in my life and Digi's and I'm sure if you follow me um, basically anywhere you will know that me and Digi have split up. Um, I have moved back home to upstate New York with my family uh, and yeah just it's been a very chaotic time. On the New Year's Eve even though I, I don't like talking about this person I do find their current trajectory interesting so Pantsu says, tonight at 12 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, I will be deactivating the Pantsu Party OnlyFans account. Let me explain what that is. Pantsu Party is not a Onision, or not Onision, but uh, Idubs, Anisa Joma, like just traditional cam whore. Her OnlyFans is anime hentai reviews. So it's just her reviewing hentai as a woman or woman sounding creature. And after she got romantically entangled with Ethan Ralph, uh, it kind of raised the question. Ethan Ralph, you are someone who rep makes fun of a lot of people and calls a lot of people pedophiles and uses things like Lolicon as a point of contention against them. But yet you are sticking your penis into a woman who reviews Lolicon and hangs Lolicon over their bed as they sleep like some sort of pedophile dream catcher. Um, Ethan Ralph why are you wh what is your explanation for this and it seems like the answer has come in the form of this message uh as pantsu party is is moving on past the the lollicon saga of her life uh i have decided to move away from creating adult content i used to make these videos in collaboration and with my ex since we've split it's been difficult for me to want to continue making hentai analysis after transitioning out of a long-term relationship where I had gotten used to sharing the details of my private life to thousands of viewers on YouTube videos, I realized I was happier keeping more personal space from the lower eye internet. It doesn't feel right to try and explain sexual thoughts and feelings in videos anymore. Many of my opinions and feelings on sexuality have changed over this year and no longer reflect some of my videos I publish here. Unfortunately, I've come to the conclusion to terminate this page. Thank you to everyone who has supported me and this project. It means a lot to me, and the revenue has helped me get back on my feet. Here's to the new year. Sayonara, May. Let me give you a theory that I heard, which I like. Um, now that May is getting gunted, she's getting the corn cop, uh, she has decided that I, uh, here are some changes to look out for. May is going to grow her hair out. She's going to let it return to a natural color, and she's going to start trying to be trad. And she's going to try to become a trad grifter, like in the conservative sphere, like Nick Fuentes style. And she's going to renounce all the Lollicon stuff and say that uh, she, she's seen the error of her ways and is now actually looking to start a family in a traditional God-fearing relationship. Uh, I, I think that's what's going to happen because, yeah, and she will blame Digibro for what happened and say it was actually Digibro who was the pedophile and Digibro who coerced me into doing these sexual things which I just didn't feel comfortable with. Woo woo woo. When really it was probably it was probably you who convinced him to transition and convince him to become a and convince him to wear female clothes and and enticed him you bonded over the Lollicon shit. And then decided, oh, wouldn't you look good as a woman? And then after Digibro was completely and totally shattered mentally, he was like, eh, well, I'm bored of this now, like a cat fucking with a mouse. I'm going to move on to, a, to the new Griff because Digibro was losing his money. After he transitioned, people didn't like his shit anymore. And he stopped uh, putting out the anime reviews that people like. And now she's in this period where she's not getting along with the anime fans because they're showing up at her house to kidnap her, allegedly. And she's thinking, what I'll do is I'll hitch on to the grift, the grift, uh, the conservative grift, 
and I'm going to get me some of that fucking money. And I bet you she's going to, like I said, dye her hair to natural colors or let it grow out, start dressing uh, with um, blouses and, and not like jeans and T-shirts. She's going to start trying to look uh, more housewifey. And she's going to try and purport conservative opinions like a Brittany Venti or an Aiden Paladin or Abigail Shapiro. She's going to get into that circle and it's going to be really pathetic. And I'm going to make fun of her when she does it. And I'm going to say that I, I called it. That's that's my feeling right now. Um, and she's going to break up with Ralph when Ralph cheats on her. <laughs> These are my predictions for 2021. Second verse, same as the first. Chameleon life. Hell yeah. I'm telling you. I'm telling you she's crypto. I'm telling you, because she's from upstate New York. Her, her parents have money, and she's got the look. She's got the look. She's crypto. She's as crypto as, as Bigfoot, is what I'm saying to you. She'll treat on, cheat on Ralph. That would be funny. Ralph would fucking kill her if she, if she cheated on him. He can't live something like that down. He'd have to prove that he's a big man and, and fucking murder her in cold blood if she cheated on him. That would be funny, too. <sighs> so many, So many possible... Possible funny things happening. The schnoz. <laughs> is a... Uh, mark my fucking words. Uh, I think she has a... I think she has a, a Bigfoot sounding last name, too. I can't remember what it, what it is off the top of my head, but I remember it sounding sus. Sounding a little bit sus. And that's not... That's not an Among Us reference, by the way. I, I really... I like to say that things were sus... Before that game fucking existed. And now that I can't say sus without people thinking, oh, this, this motherfucker's playing Among Us. He's playing with children, playing a Flash game with children and saying things are sus. Fuck you. That was my word. Before they stole it, like they stole my fonts. <laughs>